Hey everyone, Dale here. So I was in Surrey, BC last weekend taking a van similar to that one, but uh, it had a uh, wheel lift chair in it and all that with self or uh, assisted drive and I couldn't remove it. It was going to cost too much. So I sold the van to um, somebody on the island, Vancouver Island. And anyway, on the way home, this guy had some forks for sale, so I bought some of these forks. Um, might use a couple on my tractor. They were going for cheap, so I bought them all. And then he had these batteries kicking there, and I was like, hey, what's wrong with these batteries? And he says, oh, they're garbage. They're no good, you know what I mean? And I was like, well, I'll take them off your hands. And he's like, yeah, they're worth something probably for a core charge. He said they were only had like four, four four volts in it five volts but they look in like decent shape and they're agm um like gel i think so i thought maybe i can bring them back and the way i've done it in the past is you just get another 12 volt battery and i hook this to booster cables to bring this up to start charging it and then this morning i hooked the battery charger on it to this one so that it'll go through and trickle charge that because if you put this on there directly it won't charge it it won't even recognize it and when i put this on this morning it was down here so it's already charging now i may not be able to pull the amps out of these but get the 12 volts up i can always use them for you know lighting or throw them in one of my trailers because they're and uh, have it as a backup so that's my plan I got four of them. One, two, three, four. So I'm going to try this one first and see if we can bring it back up. And uh, I got a battery tester. We're going to test it out and see see what we can do. So yeah, for instance, this one, I believe, was reading... Oh, it was only reading just less than two. But I noticed this one. I'm just testing this one. And it's reading four volts so still too way too weak but let's see what it does to this battery if we can bring it back so i'm going to leave it overnight like this and see if we can get that back charged up or later tonight i'll check it and uh, see if we can bring if we can bring one back we should be able to bring most of them back and then put a solar panel on them just let them trickle charge good way to save them i mean i'm out nothing i can take these to costco and get probably 14 bucks with tax back on them so that's you know that's almost 60 bucks for four of them almost 15 bucks a piece so if anything i made some gas money but uh, i'm gonna try and bring them back and then uh yeah put a solar panel on them and see what see what i can do so it's about 11 30 at night here i'm just gonna check the see what we got oh yeah she's she's going good she's on two amps so uh it should be getting these guys charged up pretty well but uh i'll check them in the morning check this one in the morning and see what voltage we're at and see if that uh see if it helped at all but she's definitely going up and i got it set at two 12 volt 2 amps so it's just trickle charging trickle charging that guy and then going through and trickle charging this guy so yeah even if i can get away using it on my motorhome for uh to help power the fridge when i put a solar panel on that guy i'm selling that guy this year so if anybody needs a motorhome i got one but uh yeah so i'll check back in the morning and and then we'll do a test on that and see if it's uh, if it's gained anything. All right, it's the next day here. It's about 5.30 p.m. in the afternoon on March, I don't know what it is. I think it's March 10th, Sunday. So it looks like it's fully charged now. So let's put a, put a tester on it and see what we got. I'll try this one and that one and uh, see how it goes. 
Okay, so the decent battery, I mean, this isn't brand new. It's 4th of 2022. Um, this one is reading good at almost 14 volts. Let's put a load on it. Yeah, it's still in the good territory. Hot. So let's try that one now. The no effing good one. Yeah, no, it still says it's weak. Hmm. But it might be able to, uh, you know, run some solar lights and that sort of thing and act as a backup. But yeah, she goes right to zero. Well, this might be dead, but maybe I can get another one going. Um, and the other thing I'd like to do is put it on solar and see if, if I put a solar panel on it and put it on for like a month and just leave it alone, if it'll get it back up enough, uh, you know, one of them might. So I'm going to leave this video here. Stay tuned. I'm going to do another follow-up video um, with another battery and charge it up. And then I'm going to try a solar, adding solar to it. So if you haven't subscribed below, subscribe. It gives me a little motivation to do these videos. And uh, like it if you like it. And uh, come back and stay tuned because I'll do another one, I think, tonight. I'm going to try that one, and then I'll do another follow-up video on that, and then we'll put some solar on it and see what see see if that brings it back. But as for now, it's not looking good for that one, but that's the only one that has the <laughs> NFG on it. None of them else have that on it, so maybe I'll get lucky with the other three. Anyway, ciao for now, guys.